Hi, I'm Megan Sterling, Associate Professor of Art at Westmont College, and I'm so excited to be talking with you today about Leslie Dill's print, Light in Green. Leslie uh, has made several editions of similar prints in different colors, and as you can see, this one has a green background. The consistent elements in the edition of prints have been the added collage and stitched string that we see here. So you can see up top there's some stitching um, as well as on the letters of the words with strings hanging down. And then we also see some collaged elements on top of the lithograph print. Language, and specifically poetry, fuels Dill's complex investigations of how we relate to our bodies, our spirituality, and the world. When Dill received a volume of Emily Dickinson's poetry for her birthday, it dramatically changed her work. She incorporates the written word in multiple layers of textual and conceptual meaning into her work, and she often uses natural materials, such as charcoal, horsehair, and tea, as collage elements. For Dill, eyes are not only windows to the soul, they can also be paths of spiritual communication. And so in this print, we see the repeated collage element of the eye. Working at the intersection of art and language, Leslie Dill reveals the potential of words to stir feelings and convey hidden meanings. The threads dangle from the words unraveled light, which could also be a double entendre for veiled light. Emily Dickinson uses the words and description of light so often in her poetry that we can surmise that Dill is referencing Emily Dickinson. The threads dangling from the words are green and white, and they're intertwined, and they really uh, serve as a tactile element that leave the viewer guessing what Dill is referencing. Is she referencing a specific part of an Emily Dickinson poem? Are we supposed to be standing in as the viewer uh, in the photographic portion of the print? How are the eyes seeing us, or what are we seeing as the viewer? There's certainly a mystery to this print, and there's something new to engage with every time that you view it.